we are in. We are in BHVN at 45.52. Target's going to be about uh, 44.50. And stop loss will be about 46.50. About a point each way. This thing's uh, been rallying since the low pre-market. And it's looking a little weak here. So we think it drops. But if it doesn't, we're just going to come out of it. I'm not going to stick too long in this. Because it is uptrending here. Let's hope it doesn't breach the top here. Let's take a look at this thing up close. If it does, we're just going to come out of it. Not even going to wait. It looks like it's going to pop markets climbing here. All right, let's get out of this. See, just as I press to get out of it, it blasts off. That's not good. Let me cancel this. We're going to get out of this. I don't like this trade. This is going to climb here. Let's get out if we can. Big loss, but I, it's just going to climb here. All right, we're going to... We're going to push this up a little bit. I don't like this trade. Come on. I shouldn't have jumped in. It was moving pre-market. All right, we're out. We're out with about a point and 40 cent loss. Yeah, this thing, uh, I shouldn't have gone in it. Pre-market, it was climbing. It was rallying, and I thought it was just going to drop. It didn't. Good size loser right off bat. LLY, we're going to take this for a short right here at the ask. If we can get in. All right, we are in. We're in at uh, 141.49. I like the way it tried to climb here. And it's given out, so we think it's going to crack the lows here. Target on this thing is going to be about 140.50 area. And stop loss will be uh, around 142.25 area. Here it comes. Here we go. Let's take a look at this thing up close. Coming down nicely here. Only thing is the market is screaming. I like to see a crack 141 and down to at least 140.50 area. But the market's screaming. I actually shouldn't have jumped in this. LLY, we're going to come out of this right here. At the bid, if we can get out, we're out. Yeah, this is going to blast off here. I wasn't looking at the SPY. The SPY was cranking. And uh, yeah, not a good morning so far. Two good-sized losers right off bat. But if this thing goes over uh, the top here, which it already did, I think it's just going to blast right off, and I don't want to be part of that. This thing will go up to 144, 145 in a heartbeat. Because if we look at the daily here, look at the daily. This thing is a beast. I should have never gone in this short anyway. LLY, look at it here. See? It's probably going to blast right off o over the top here. Roku, we're going to take this for a long right here at the bid. If we can get in before it cracks over the highs here. This thing looks ready to blast off. It's a little risky, but we're going to try it. All right, we're in. We're in Roku at 129.21. We've got a bull flag here, a really nice looking one. So we're going to see if we can take this over 130. If we can get to 130.50, that'd be great. If not, stop loss is going to be around, uh, around 128.50 area. And we've got volume. The market's climbing, so... I don't see why this thing doesn't blast off. You got a lot of shorts you're gonna have to cover if this thing goes over the top here. And that's what we're betting on. But if it doesn't, I'm just gonna come out of it because it can just easily drop two points just like that. But I only see one red candle here. There, everything else is green, so I don't see why not. All right, come on. Let's take this over the top here. All right, here we go, come on. We're gonna test the top here. Keep my eye on the market. If the market starts to drop, I'm just going to come out of this trade because it has been climbing for a while. Roku, we're going to come out of this right here if we can. I don't like this market. It's starting to drop here. Let's get out of this. All right, we're out. We're out for about, what is that, close to 15 cents. And I, it's probably a mistake. This thing is probably going to blast over the top here. TSLA, we're going to take this for a short right here at the ask. We can get in. This looks great here for a continuation to the downside here. But uh, we are going to give this about a two-point stop loss. So t target on this is going to be about 7.98.50 um, area. Let's take a look at this thing up close here. All right. Here we go. That's where we want it right here. Oh, let's take this right here if we can. Nice. Nice. We got a little over, uh, we got two and a half points, pretty much a little over two and a half points, which brought us back to green. Boy, did we need that. Nice. And it's probably going to continue to drop, but I'm not going to leave uh, two and a half points on the table there. 
BHVN, we're going to take this for another short here. It's looking a little weak. We think it continues to drop here. It tried to climb. We, we took a good size loser on it, but it looks weak here. Low on volume, but all right, we are in. We're at 46.90. We're going to see if we can take this back and at least get back what we lost on it, at least half of that. Target's going to be about uh, 46 area, and stop loss will be around 47, 75 area. About a point each way. But we took that good size winner on TSLA, which brought the day back to green. I was a little concerned after taking those two good sized losers there, but we're back on track here. BHVN, let's take a look at this thing up close. But the market's climbing. This thing, if we look at the SPY here, it's climbing. Take a look at this thing. I should probably get out of this trade, but it's not climbing with the market, so I'm thinking it's going to drop. There is very low volume though. That's the only problem. So if it doesn't drop soon, we're just going to come out of it with whatever we can get back from that earlier loss. BHVN, we're actually going to come out of this right here if we can. There's no volume in this. All right, we're out. We took, what is that, uh, a nine cent gain off of this. I just, if we look at the volume bars here, there's like barely nothing. LLY, we're going to short this one more time here. All right, we are in. We're in at 142.63. We took it earlier and we took uh, about, what is that? Took about a 75 cent loser on it. It's looking a little weak now. We think it drops again here back to at least 141.50, and that's what we'll take it around there. I think if it cracks, 142 should be a nice ride down, but we'll, we'll, we'll manage it. Market is climbing though, but this thing is weak today, so we think it continues to downtrend. But if we look at the daily, it is pretty strong. The daily is strong, but it's, it's on its way down here. Let's take a look at this thing up close. LLY. All right, it's coming down towards 142. Let's see how how it handles down there. If it doesn't handle well at 142, we're just going to come out of it. LLY. I'm thinking about getting out of this thing. Market's just continuously climbing. This thing is probably going to start climbing too. Let's get out of this right here if we can. All right, we're out of 100. All right, we're full out. We'll pull out for about 20, a little over 20 cents. Oh, and now it starts to drop, but that's all right. The market's climbing like really nice, and this is probably going to turn around and climb. But as you can see right now, it's still dropping. That's thanks. Anyways, traders, that's going to be it for us today. Don't really see anything else that looks good. The market is uh, pretty much just climbing. Climbing real nice. It's grinding higher this morning. But we don't see anything else that looks good. We took two good sized losers right off bat. But we made it back and some. We're up 126. Let's take a look at the trades. Six trades, four winners, two losers. Our biggest winner on TSLA and our biggest loser on BHVN. Thanks for watching.